Hey everybody, welcome back to another Circuit Basics tutorial. My name is Scott, and today I'm going to show you how to change the rotation of your LCD touchscreen for the Raspberry Pi. In the last video, I went over how to install the drivers and configure the basic settings for uh, getting your LCD touchscreen working. So if you haven't seen that video, you might want to go back and check that out. But in this video, we're just going to focus on changing the screen rotation. So let's get started here. First thing you want to do is uh, log in to the Raspberry Pi command prompt. I'm using PuTTY. Now the first thing we need to do is edit the boot command line file. So enter sudo nano forward slash boot forward slash cmd line dot txt. And all the way at the end of this line, there's an option to change screen rotation. It's at the very end. Go down there and see the command for fbtft underscore device dot rotate equals zero. You want to change this to 90. And this will change the screen orientation to landscape mode. All right, once you've done that, Control X and yes to save and exit. And then we need to reboot, so sudo reboot. And then log back in. Okay, now that's all you need to do to change the screen rotation. But we need to change the rotation of the touchscreen driver as well. Otherwise, the X and Y axes will be inverted from what you see on the screen. So to do that, we need to edit the modules file. So enter sudo nano forward slash etc forward slash modules. Go down to the line that starts with ads7846 underscore device and scroll over to the command that says swap underscore xy equals zero and change that to one. Okay, and that's gonna swap the orientation of the xy axes for the touchscreen. Now save and exit. Now we need to reboot, so sudo reboot. log back in. Now we need to install two packages, xinput and evtest. So enter sudo apt-get dash y install x input ev test. Press enter. Let that download and install. And now reboot. And then log back in. So installing X input and EV test created a configuration file for us that will allow us to change some other settings for our touchscreen driver. And we need to edit that file. So enter sudo nano forward slash etc forward slash x11 forward slash x in it forward slash x in it rc and then above the line that starts with a period you 
you want to enter this code. Go to my blog post for Raspberry Pi touchscreen calibration and screen rotation. And scroll down. This will have all the detailed steps for doing this too. You might want to have a look at this after watching the video if anything's unclear. And copy the code. Paste that in there. And then press save and exit. And then we need to reboot. And when we boot up again, you should see that the boot text is now oriented in landscape mode. And when you touch the touchscreen, the arrow will follow. It's not inverted. Now the next step will be to calibrate the touchscreen. So check out the next video for Raspberry Pi LCD touchscreen calibration. And I'll show you how to do that. All right, and as always, if you have any questions, leave a comment in the comment section below. And I'll talk to you later. All right, bye-bye.